Welcome to third part of Gaming PC Build Parts 2020. Today I will provide $500 Gaming Build Parts, so let's get started. AMD's Ryzen 5 2600 was, and still is, one of the best budget CPUs money could buy. Thanks to the introduction of their Ryzen 3000 Zen 2 CPUs, the second gen CPUs now showcase even better value for money. I know, God bless the processor war. This processor comes to shelves boasting 6 cores and 12 threads clocked at a base speed of 3.4 GHz more than enough to handle the most popular AAA game titles out there. That being said, it can be boosted to 3.9 GHz with AMD's Precision Boost. It has been custom designed for gamers and has superb single core performance, perfect for games. The multi-threaded nature of this CPU also makes it a standout performer when it comes to multitasking and heavy workload tasks as well. All in all, a fantastic CPU at an affordable price tag. The RX 570 is considered the top budget GPU in this price range and comes equipped with all the punching power of its master, the RX 580. This GPU can easily provide 1080p 60fps in most modern games on max settings. The RX 570 isn't quite ready for VR gaming or higher resolutions. It can handle some lesser intensity of VR titles but doesn't provide you with that immersive experience you would want. Certainly forgivable for a budget card under $200 though. Its performance is far above that of the PS4, and around that of the PS4 Pro. If you're looking for the best graphical performance you can get for around $150 then look no further. The XFX Radeon RX 570 offers superb aesthetics, excellent performance power, and an efficient cooling solution to boot. XPG Z1 RAM kit offers 16GB of DDR4 RAM, which should be more than enough for most gaming and multitasking scenarios. It displays solid value for money and the slight bump in clock speed naturally makes it better than a lot of entry-level DDR4 RAM kits you'll find out there. As with most budget builds, compromises have to be made to ensure the performance power is up to scratch. With our $500 custom build, the storage capacity has taken a slight hit. We had to opt for the 240GB add to SSD to make sure we have enough room in the budget for the bolstered RX 570 GPU. Unfortunately, we weren't able to equip our $500 build with a modular PSU. Having said that, our course or 450 watts bronze rated PSU will power this machine like a dream and will provide great efficiency for years to come. For a custom build at this price range, the MSIB 450 Gaming Plus Max motherboard is pretty much perfect. It might not be a premium motherboard but it still offers a bunch of features and is ready for upgrades when the time comes. Furthermore, you don't yet have the budget to get the components to justify something more expensive at this price range anyway. Motherboards also don't really affect gaming performance at all so it fits into this build nicely. Aerocool is a fantastic brand when it comes to computer cases, and their Cylon is a brilliant example of the quality they provide. It comes to shelves offering great airflow, a clean and user-friendly design, a pre-installed rear 120mm fan, and a bunch of build-friendly features as well. As far as negatives go, it obviously doesn't have any tempered glass for internal viewing which for some is total sacrilege. But, apart from that, it's a pretty rock-solid case that should last you for the foreseeable future. 